our YouTube, another quick video for ya. So, I got an order for a lighter. Someone had asked me previously to do a video on a lighter. And this is, might not be the lighters um, that they were looking for. Let me put some light on the situation. But these are the, um, these are the lighters I prefer. They're torch lighters, so good for what if. Um, but... So someone did want a custom ordered um, lighter, so they sent this picture. I'm gonna kind of show it right there. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna sublimate it onto this. This here is 651 vinyl. You can see that, right? However, it has laminate on it. So I don't know if you can see that. So the laminate has already been adhered to the 651 so that you can then sublimate on it and then apply items that way. I hope that makes sense. So like in the case of this lighter, instead of just putting like sticker paper on it, it's laminated. So if it gets wet, I don't have to worry about it. If that makes sense. Or And I don't have to put tape over it. Um, so this is how I make the lighters for the most part. So the laminate came off of Amazon, I'm sure, if not Staples. I'll have to find what that is. And then that I will link below because that's not typical, right? Most of the stuff, y'all, you know where to get stuff from. So don't look for me to be um, citing nothing. But the laminate, I will. Um, so you would take the laminate, you would sub it to, or I'm sorry, you would um, uh, heat press it onto the 651. 651 vinyl, we all use it, it's pretty, you know, cheap. And now you have it ready to then sublimate on and then pr press this piece on once you cut it out to whatever you want. In my case, it's gonna be a lighter. So, since this is cut out perfectly for what I need, so scraps, scraps, like I said, throw nothing away. You are gonna hear that from me every day, all day, and then on Sunday. So I'm going to place it on here evenly and then I'm gonna use my skinny tape again. Finally, a good use for this damn skinny tape. So I'm going to tape it so it doesn't move, so there's no ghosting. I got but butcher paper here so that nothing, you know, goes through onto my heat press. Let me get it down. So, I haven't done this in a while, I have to be honest. Where is my, uh, I need a top piece. Let me use this. I just used this for the other video, but I'm gonna use it. So I have this set for 400 um, for 60 seconds, but I'm pretty sure it's not gonna take that long. So let me go ahead and press it. And then I'll bring this, um, bring this back. I'm gonna cover this side up because I don't want this Actually, I'm gonna cut this out because I don't want to mess up the rest of it. I'm gonna cut this piece so that, of course, these scissors are not good. I can use this for future, like I'm using it now. All right. All right, so let me press and I'll be back. the picture it came out all right this is good as it's gonna get it was screenshotted to me and now I'm gonna use this excuse me use this lighter and then wrap it around here because it's going to stick so it's a little bit bigger than the um than the uh, lighter, which is fine because I need to trim it anyway. So while I'm sitting here talking to you, let me trim it down. These are my good scissors. Trim the white part off. Trim it a little, let's let that the top. All right, so I will usually start on this end and then just wrap it around, but I'm just gonna take a look to see how far I need to go first. 
So you see the overage. So there's a hump here. Let me get in the camera. So there's a hump here. Let me show from the side. So this is gonna be exposed. I always leave this exposed because I don't have time to be cutting this out right here. I don't, it's not even worth it, right? So let me just bring that around again. So it's gonna basically end up like this, right? So I could conceivably cut it so that this will go and meet here and I may do that, we'll see. I just need to first get started on it and then see how I feel when when I get around that way. So it might not be enough though. So no, I can't do that. So it's not long enough to do that. So it's gonna stop right here. And then I could cut it so that it comes here, but this, this orange part is still gonna show, but it is what it is. So maybe I will do it, let's see. Um, it's a lot of trimming that's going to need to go on, but then this is what will be left. And that's what they wanted, and that's what they're going to get. All right, so then what we do is peel this away because it's been sublimated on so we can take off the back. So just like if you were weeding a, a 651, it's the same difference. So I just got to catch it, though. There it is. Okay. So I'm just taking off the 651. We don't need this part, right? This is all sticky. So this is what sticks onto here. The good part is, is that you can kind of remove it and bring it back, but I don't want to do it too much. So I'm gonna try to get it on here so I don't have to keep going. And then I get it in place and just do that side and then just gently go around. It's looking even, thank goodness. Okay. It looks even anyway. See, you can easily take that off and then redo it. So many times, of course, but. So, basically, I'm smushing it down on this part because around here is fine. Around this side, it's all good in the hood, right? It's this part that the maneuvering comes into place. It still is relatively simple and easy to do, right? So see how shiny that is? I don't have to do anything else to it. It's laminated, right? So where's my X-Acto? Actually, I need my small scissors. I don't know where they are. I think they're in my craft room, but... I'm going to use my exacto. Pray that I don't cut myself, right? So this can conceivably meet together. So I'm going to go ahead and try. So I'm just going to cut right there. Right under the the right under that uh lip. Right under that lip. Scissors. <sighs> there we go. So right under this lip. These scissors are sharp enough. So this one's going to come over. This one's going to go over top. It takes care of that, okay? So for this part up here, I'm gonna have to trim that out because that's not gonna work. No, that looks weird. So I'm gonna, it's gonna have to end right there. So I need the smaller scissors. Yeah, that's not gonna work. I need to find my smaller scissors. Okay. 
You know, that's not going to work. All right. But let me see if I can find my smaller scissors. I'll be right back. Found them. Let's see if I can get that to work. Yep. And I thought having the extra scissors would might be a waste of time. Nope. And the sharp. My bad. I'm being nosy outside, see what's going on, y'all. I think our neighbors are moving. We need to. But anyway. Um yeah, I think that's that's it. That is it. So so I'm trying to press it down pressure pressure but honestly that's it that's it lighter done so the good thing like i said about this is that i don't have to do anything else you see the shine it's laminated so it's nothing that i need to do whereas if i had sticker paper i would need to put something over top of it um so that god forbid not that it would get wet but so that it just doesn't smear out right the picture quality is the picture quality you send it to me i can only do what i can do right but this actually is a done deal got to just put it in the mail it didn't take long at all so I got these um, lighters off of Amazon. Um, I will link the laminate paper that I use. You all know where you can get 651 from. Um, and that's it. That's it. That's all. So hopefully um, they like it and maybe they'll order more. You can uh, advertise these for whatever, right? You can do this for special occasions. They could be gift giveaways. It could be for your uh, cigar aficionado who maybe... You know, you want to put somebody on his lighter just like this or her lighter. Like, let's not be discriminatory, right? Okay. So that's it. Another one out there for you. Let me know if you have any questions. Please consider subscribing, sharing the video, liking, and commenting. Have any questions? You want me to do anything? Let me know. I do just about everything that's out there. Um, working on some crafts for this weekend's project. But other than that, I'm out of here. So I will see you all on the next one. Thank you.